So you've installed Lightroom, you've downloaded some photos, and now you're ready to make your pictures beautiful. The first thing that you're probably gonna do is head on over to the develop module because that's where all the tools are, right? Well, did you know that in the library module, you can actually edit your photographs right from here. Perfect for today's Friday Quickie is the quick develop. You see what I did there? Over on the right hand side is the quick develop option. And if you drop this down, you'll see three categories, saved presets, white balance, and tone control. If you don't see all the adjustments that I see here, it could be because these sections are closed down. Just go ahead and hit the little black checkbox triangle looking thing here and your options will drop down. From here, you can do all kinds of things. You can head on into the develop setting, choose a preset that's already built into Lightroom. You can even crop your photo from here by choosing any particular crop ratio. Now you don't have the ability to readjust the crop. It pretty much just applies from the center inward. From here, you can even auto tone a picture and you can choose any one of these other options as you see here. The single arrow will move the increments in fives and the double increment will move it in 20. I'll actually show you what that does here in a second. And last but not least, we'll add a little bit of clarity to this picture. So without ever leaving the library module, we're able to edit this photograph pretty good. We're not saying it's perfect, but it's pretty good. It's good enough for you to share this with friends and family without getting hung up on making it perfect. It's important to note that any adjustments that you make here in the quick develop module are actually happening on the develop side. So there was really no need to go to the develop side, but just so that you could see what I'm talking about, let's head back to develop and there you'll see every adjustment that I've made. I made some adjustments to exposure. We've added some contrast and there, Highlights was moved at plus five because we use the single arrow and shadows was moved to 40 because we move the shadows double slider two times. That's 20 times two for you math challenged people. And so there you have it. Editing in the quick develop from the library module. Quick, easy, fast, perfect for our Friday quickie. Have a great weekend. We'll be back with new episodes on Monday.